Today we're going to be making lettuce cups. So you may have had San Chabao, which is a Chinese version of this. You may have had Lab, which is traditionally um, from Laos, and there's versions from Thailand. But essentially, it's a lettuce cup filled with uh, ground meat, typically, but we're going to be doing a mixture of tofu and mushroom. It's going to be really textured. It's going to be full of flavor. We're going to get lots of different sauces in there and it's going to be incredible. So let's just get straight into it. Start by getting a packet of extra firm tofu and we're going to squeeze some of the moisture out of that with a tea towel. Don't worry if you press quite hard and it kind of crumbles apart, we are going to rip it up later. So we'll slice the middle open and remove the moisture from the center. This is just going to help it to brown later on. So we're going to dice half a brown onion. We're also going to crush and finely dice two large cloves of garlic. Finally slice one small bird's eye chili or any chili you have for that matter, depending on how hot you would like it. Heat your wok till it's smoking hot. Then we're going to add in our vegetable oil followed by our onions. Next, we're going to use the white part from two spring onions and we're going to add that to the mix as well. Next, we're going to crumble in our tofu. Use your spatula to help you break the tofu into smaller pieces and to kind of break the onion down a little bit. Next, we're going to chop about four portobello mushrooms and we're going to get ready to add them next. So they're going to release quite a little bit of moisture. So we want to add them when the tofu is kind of looking dry, it's browning. So next we're going to add just one carrot and give that a fine dice. Keep your wok on medium high and the mushrooms should start to break down like this. Now to make our sauce. So to a little bowl, we're gonna add two teaspoons of hoisin sauce, two teaspoons of regular soy sauce or tamari, one teaspoon of sesame oil, one teaspoon of Chinese cooking wine, one teaspoon of dark soy for the color and half a teaspoon of corn flour to help bind everything together. Stir everything until it becomes a nice thick sauce. So over in our wok, our mushrooms are starting to get some color on them and everything's breaking down a bit. So now we're gonna add our aromatic, so our chili and our garlic at this stage. Next, we're gonna go in with our carrot. And we're gonna grate in around half a teaspoon of ginger. Now we're gonna start with six teaspoons of the sauce. You can always add more. You can't obviously remove it after you've added it, so just go easy. Also, if you want to adjust the salt, just add some more soy sauce. So we're going to go in with a quarter teaspoon of allspice and a quarter teaspoon of white pepper. Now we're going to kind of let those spices bloom. So we're going to want to cook this for a further minute before adding the chopped up water chestnuts. So I just got these out of a tin. They're great and we'll give it a taste. I added the rest of my sauce. Next, I'm gonna finally slice the green part of those two spring onions we used earlier. And I'm gonna take about a tablespoon of each white and black sesame seeds and just give them a light toast. If you've got toasted sesame seeds, awesome. If not, just get a dry pan like this. Toast for, until they are golden and take them out. Now we're gonna make a really easy dipping sauce. So we're gonna add two tablespoons of uh, sweet chili sauce to a little bowl, followed by one tablespoon of vinegar. Then just give it all a mix. Give your filling one final taste. I decided that I needed a little bit more soy sauce in mine. Now we're going to begin filling our lettuce cups. 
they look so beautiful. We're gonna go really generous with the filling. And once they're all filled and looking beautiful, we're gonna add some of our toppings. So we're gonna to add our toasted sesame seeds. We're also gonna add our sliced spring onions, followed by a couple of little coriander leaves. And there you have it. Add our easy dipping sauce to the side and now you're ready to devour these. All right, let's try a lettuce cup, a little bit of lime. Mmm. The toasted sesame seeds give it this like lovely nuttiness. There's a little bit of spice from the five spice but all in all, it feels very Chinese, Sancho Bao influenced. It's really nice, really healthy, super easy to whip up during a weeknight. It's also great, you can make it ahead of time and reheat it and serve little lettuce cups to your guests or at a picnic or whatever. So if you do make this one, please let me know. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and I hope you have a great day.